So for this question, we're to determine how we want to get paid for a one-month job. A million dollars up front, pretty good, sounds pretty tempting there. Uh, or a penny on the first day and then have the pay doubled each day for the rest of the month. Well, let's see. We'll try and analyze this a bit and see which is in fact the better option. So option one, fairly straightforward. A million bucks. And there we go. Uh, option number two, a little more creative here. And so in this case, um, it's definitely exponential growth, compounding. Um, and so if we were to figure out the amount at any given time, we could say the original amount, and then we're doubling it each time. And so then we can say D for the number of days, or you could put T if you wish for time. And, um, and so let's try and analyze that for our situation. So in our situation, we're starting off with a penny. So initially that doesn't sound too promising, uh, getting paid for a penny for the first day and two pennies for the second day and four pennies for the third day and so on. Um, yeah, it probably doesn't sound like the better option at this point, but let's carry on. Uh, for the D in this case, standing for the days, now we're talking about one month. So we could put 30 here. Now, of course, um, that makes a bit of an assumption on which month. Um, if we were talking about February, it'd be less. If we we're talking about January, it'd be more. But um, perhaps we'll start with 30. And if it becomes questionable, we can try the February or we try the January and stuff like that. But let's start off here. So uh, we go and multiply this out. Uh, on our calculator, uh, 2 to the power of 30 multiplied by 0 0.01. And we come up with, might be a bit surprising, but uh, 10,737,480 dollars and 24 cents. So yeah, on the 30th day, we're getting paid around a little over 10 times what we would have been paid for the total month in the other option, option one. So yeah, clearly option two is the winner. And this isn't even considering that that's the pay on that day. Um, we could use our sequences and series ideas, uh, you know, sum of series and figure out what all of the amounts added up will give us. But bottom line is it's clear that this is the better option. 